Hey all, TSG here with a new video about Korean the Dungeon that we promised and this one is gonna be an amazing video because this dungeon is like really smooth and well, depends how you play it but for us it went really smooth this time so yeah in the beginning we always buff up a little bit and we get we we try to get coriander in that little corner there that you will see in a few uh, seconds I think Ekka or Kra yeah there Kra will do it we put him in that position and then as soon as the treacherous will summon the stump we put it directly behind the coriander that way he can't summon more than one little spider thing because they are so annoying they can push you back um, in, an, um, in a glyph and they deal some quite a lot of damage and yeah if you stand in the glyph you die it's that simple you die this is like um, you can compare it with Kimbo it's a little bit the same but this way you, you can just hit him something you know except for the circulars because you cannot use spells on them if you do you'll probably die because everyone will roll back to the place they start with and yeah you die okay so right here in the beginning we could already do some hits and stuff try to do as much damage because you have to kill Coriander quite quick you cannot save for last really you can't you will resurrect uh, things and it just you don't you don't want him there you just want him to die want him to die <laughs> okay so the stump is now right behind him so coriander can't go anywhere only if you stand in a line to him he can hit you so we put everyone like in a nice position get the monsters away from us so they can't reach us and yeah then you just hit you kind of blitz it to death here uh, actually and for IOPS be sure that you uh, do a wrath because you're going to have to use it on that um, Dramonita the Dramonita is really annoying it's the little purple well pink it's a pink mushroom he poisons you and it really hurts if you use AP with it so you tend to MP rape it and range rape it as much as possible and get it far away. Um, it's also nice to keep the Fistolina away because he's really annoying as well because he's like hello pff, pff, pff. it's like a punch of crack or something and then he hits you really hard and he can heal his teammates as well depending on his HP. And don't let him close to your NI at all because then you will get minus heals. Um, you see there in the right corner in the top the both fungors sitting together like they're drinking a cup, cup of tea or something in uh, this dungeon you don't have to hit them at all because they will just uh, basically buff everyone oh look coriander's dead that was really nice okay you think yeah coriander's dead yeah really nice and all but no now the fight actually starts because as you see the spaces are getting filled and filled and filled you cannot stand in it anymore and if your ally dies the spaces get available again but you don't really want that anyway so yeah right here um, we want the drum meter gone because it's annoying and stuff and yeah okay let's see what else is dangerous the circulars yeah um, you can only close combat those so daggers are really nice with them or anything because it's minus agility so you can kill them really quick and fistlinas oh you can just hammer them storm cloud people love it okay so as you see boom dead that was the annoying part of this and the tree stress also does a ray of effect big damage and EAP rates like that it's really annoying and yeah if uh, as you see the NI is a little bit far away so that's all fine actually but 
it's also good because she cannot be in a pinch or anything most people are like I've seen videos and they're like um, just letting it half die and I'm like why? but okay so as you see this is going really well and I think I did kind of all of the points already um, I don't know if I can tell anything else um, let me think a little bit yeah I don't really know anything anymore that's basically all of it you need to look good at the steps where you're going and you have to be really clever because yeah this all dungeon is all about thinking 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 what to do and where you can stand like there and I uh, the NI couldn't go anywhere anymore really so I'm like Yay! going over there smash her away well throw her away and yeah as Missy says she pawns this dungeon she can solo this dungeon she's just hex like that you know there now I'm just I don't know <laughs> okay um, yeah, I really cannot tell anything else anymore because this is basically it. You just have to keep uh, looking where you're standing, look at your teammates, where they are standing. And also you cannot stand next to a monster ever. Well, you can, but not if you're on the glyph because you, you, you're you stuck. They, the Fungors cast a spell that causes minus 100 luck and dodge or something yeah and then you cannot move at all okay um, I think I w no, um, another three minutes long um, I can also just let you enjoy the music but no we probably have to do this dungeon again as well because of the new updates and it's all meh but yeah as you see there Boom, Circular is gone. Everyone's still alive. Meiji and the Eka. Hazel is a little bit on low HP, but they're still fine. They can both heal uh, their HP right back up with Valentin and Meiji with Alka Hammer. So it's all fine. Ooh, look. That was one non full smash of a sword. Alright. So everyone back to position right there in the back. Really in this dungeon we were like sitting, fighting. We were like, wow, this is going so well. It was really amazing. I have actually no idea what fear is coming after this dungeon. It's probably Colosso, but we, st we didn't try Colosso yet. So I can't promise anything. Um, if it's not Colosso, it can be any other dungeon. You can leave a comment or something and I'll just see if we can do it. We want to try Oga as well, because it's amazing. I don't know, the equipments are worth it. And the uh, resources. Um, right. I think we're already close at the end now. Or not. I cannot scroll on my bar. Okay, that fails. Okay. Um, what else can I talk about? Maybe I forgot something. I'm not sure. Let me think. I like chocolate and trains. That's beside the point. Okay. Um. Okay, yeah, I think we're at the end already, and we're gon gonna last. There are two Fungors left, but they will die really quick. Oh, also circular. <gasps> My music is gone. Give it back. Give it back. Ah, thank you. Oh yeah, this is um, gonna be like boom, boom, boom with the hammer from Lizaria, and she's gonna be like the superstar, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. 
Well, I want to thank you all for watching. If you have any other questions about this dungeon or like you want tips, you can just uh, leave a comment or private message or contact me on Lupus or you can contact uh, my wifey because Team Turk is awesome like that. Um, yeah, okay. Thank you all for watching again and I hope you're looking forward to our next video. That's gonna be anything. Up to you guys. And yeah, okay. This is the experience, the drops, and yeah, okay. I wanna thank you all for watching and, and take care. Take care. And keep watching the videos because I know you like it. <laughs>